Are your tasks scattered across Gmail, Slack, Notion, and like five other places that you've already forgotten about? Hey, this is my AkiFlow Review 2025, where I test out one of the best productivity apps that promises to clean up the chaos. AkiFlow wants to be your single central time management hub, syncing your calendar, consolidating your tasks, and saving you from constant context switching. So if you've ever felt like managing your time has become a full-time job, this one is for you. First things first, what is AkiFlow? At its core, AkiFlow Productivity Tool is a digital planner and a smart calendar. And it's more than just a to-do list or scheduling app. It's designed to be a command center for everything I might need to get done. Whether my tasks live in Gmail or various workflow management apps or a sticky note in my mind, AkiFlow helps pull them all into one focused, organized view. It's built to centralize my tasks, unify my schedule, and help me stay productive without feeling overwhelmed. Now, here's how AkiFlow actually works. It connects with all the tools I potentially already use, like Gmail and Google Calendar, Outlook, Notion, ClickUp, Trello, Zoom, and more. Once connected, it automatically imports my tasks and calendar events, syncing them in real time. I can even drag and drop any task, whether I created it in AkiFlow or if it came from another app, directly into my calendar to time block my day. It's all visual, fast, and flexible. One thing to note though, AkiFlow doesn't fully support offline mode yet. You would need an internet connection to keep everything synced and updated. That said, performance is smooth. Even with multiple integrations running, in my experience, there's minimal lag and everything feels pretty responsive. The best part is that I am not jumping between tabs or windows just to keep track of my day. It's all in one place. If you are ready to save time organizing, you can get to AkiFlow directly through this QR code via the link in the description. Logging in takes a few seconds and there's a 7-day trial to let you try all of the AkiFlow features. There's nothing to lose and a more organized life to gain. Alright, now let's explore the real power of AkiFlow, its features. One of the things that makes AkiFlow stand out to me is task consolidation. I can pull in tasks from Trello, Google Calendar, Slack, and more all into one centralized inbox. And it's not just read only. If I check off a task in AkiFlow, it'll update in Notion or wherever it came from. That kind of bi-directional sync is wonderful. When it comes to task management, I'm not limited to basic checklists. I can assign time slots, set durations, add deadlines, and even create recurring tasks. And if something gets pushed, I can snooze it or delete it with a single click. It gives me full control without micromanaging. Then there's event management, which really helps if I'm scheduling meetings or just trying to stay on top of appointments. I can book events directly in AkiFlow, choose Zoom or Google Meet, and even send a link to share my availability. So there's no back and forth trying to find a time that works. AkiFlow also includes a built-in AI assistant. It's subtle, which means it doesn't get in the way. I can take it or leave it. When I create a task, it can automatically assign it to a project and add relevant tags based on my habits. I can turn it off, but in my opinion, it's a real time saver, especially once it starts to learn my workflow. That said, some users have asked for deeper AI features, something to keep an eye out for. I personally like the time slots feature. It lets me group tasks into one block so I can stay focused instead of bouncing around. Then there's statistics, which is perfect for anyone who wants to audit how their time is being spent. For freelancers especially, it's helpful to see how much time went to which client or which project. And if you like organizing your work, AkiFlow has projects and tags so you can sort and filter tasks with precision. Moreover, AkiFlow presents a very interesting feature. It's the command bar. Kind of like my control panel. I can add or delete tasks from anywhere in the app using shortcuts. And I'll be honest, it took me a few tries to remember all the symbols and hotkeys, but once I did, it seriously boosted my speed. 
If you're just getting started, there's even a full AccuFlow beginner's guide available right on their site to help you master all of this without feeling lost. I actually had to use it myself a few times. By the way, if you've got questions about how AccuFlow compares to other tools or want help setting it up, drop a comment down below. I'll be checking and replying. Now, with a tool this powerful, support really matters. And honestly, AccuFlow does a great job here. You get a one-on-one -on -one onboarding session when you sign up, which I found super helpful for getting familiar with the layout and all the integrations. There's also a dedicated support agent, so if something doesn't make sense, you're not left digging through forums. On top of that, they offer productivity coaching, technical support, and even webinars to help you get the most out of the platform. What I also really appreciate is that AccuFlow is transparent about what's coming next. You can check their public roadmap anytime to see what new features are in the works. It's at product.acuflow.com and it shows that they're listening to users and evolving fast. Now, once I'm inside AccuFlow, the first thing I notice is that it looks pretty intuitive in comparison to, say, Notion. It's available on Windows, Mac, iOS, Android, and in your browser. So no matter where you work, it adapts. Personally, I love how sleek the interface looks. It's modern, minimal, and doesn't feel cluttered like a lot of productivity apps out there. I can view my calendar, drag tasks into time slots, snooze or complete them, and manage projects with just a few clicks. Across every platform I tested, AccuFlow ran smooth and stable, no bugs and no lag at any point. That said, there is a bit of a learning curve, especially if you're new to task planners, but AccuFlow does a great job guiding you through setup with tutorials, tool tips, and a searchable help center. And while the layout is definitely geared toward visual thinkers, once you get into the flow, it starts to feel second nature. When it comes to pricing, you may be asking yourself, is AccuFlow free? Well, AccuFlow offers two plans, monthly and yearly. In my personal opinion, the monthly plan seems a bit steep for what you're getting short term. But the yearly plan not only gives you more functionality, it's also a much better value overall, especially if you're serious about staying organized for the long haul. This isn't the kind of app that you try for a month or two and move on. It's a system you build around. It's a keeper. And once you get into the rhythm, it really pays off. Plus, there's a seven-day free trial, so you can explore all the features and integrations before committing. If you're curious to see how AccuFlow Timeline Management Tool could streamline your day, the link is waiting for you down in the description below this video. Just tap it and dive in. No pressure, no commitment, just a smarter way to start organizing your time. Or start your AccuFlow journey via the QR code you now see on this screen. So, here's my take. AccuFlow is one of the most capable tools I've used for bringing order to a scattered workday. It centralizes my tasks from everywhere, Gmail, Notion, Slack, my calendars, and brings them into one clean, focused dashboard. What stood out the most for me? The visually appealing interface, the sheer number of integrations, and how flexible it is for changing needs. Whether I'm switching jobs or juggling between different freelance clients with totally different systems. If you want more reviews like this, check out our other videos where I break down the best productivity tools to help you work smarter, not necessarily harder. Thank you for watching this health news video, and I will see you in the next one.